for those of you who are here just to see our information nutrition on our muffin this is what we came up with 252 calories three grams of fat cholesterol is four sodium is 426 potassium is 370 carbs are 40 fibers 9 12 for sugars protein 19 and vitamin A. It's got a lot of vitamin A. I met him on a sunny day in late July and everything turned upside down. I almost lost track of time as weeks went by. I am sitting here answering comments this morning, going through what I'm going to make for breakfast here. I've got my breakfast pre-planned, which I have two points left over. I did put two Diet Coke there because that's what I figured I would have, but I don't think I will now because I'm sick. And I think I'll have two coffees instead. So I have coffee there. And then I have my Puffs Plus. And I always get the Puffs with lotion when I'm sick because then it doesn't hurt my nose. My nose doesn't turn red. And I'm blowing my nose an awful lot today. <laughs> and it just hit us like overnight. Corey got up and he was going to go to the meeting and he just, he couldn't. So he went back to bed. And that's what's going on right now. I'm going to start myself some breakfast. It is... Almost 10 o'clock. We didn't get up till like 9, uh, probably after 9, but I've been sitting answering comments. They really want to eat, and I just haven't felt like getting up off this chair yet. Have I mentioned that this morning I woke up to 9,000 subscribers? Oh my gosh, I'm so excited about that. I am just floored by that amount. I never expected that many subscribers at all. So thank you, everyone who has subscribed to me. I really appreciate you guys. And we're going to try to hit 10,000 this year. We'll see if we can do it. Frying up three slices of this ham. And it's under one and a quarter ounces, which is zero smart points. And it's 1020 right now because we're so sick. And I decided just to not cook breakfast early. <laughs> Corey's still sleeping. So I couldn't wait anymore. I was getting hungry. So I'm making mine and then I'll just make his when he wakes up. What I do is I use a Olay wrap. Put it on a plate. And then I use one slice of Velveeta, rip it in half, and then I will be adding my ham to that once it's fried up. I removed my ham, put it on my burrito, and I put one egg in there. And I used like a five second spray of the spritz of oil there. And then I put a couple tablespoons of the egg white in there. I'll put some salt and pepper on there. I added some sweet potato habanero hot sauce to my burrito and my eggs are done so I'm going to throw those on top. Guys this is breakfast I'm still working on my first coffee. I have my burrito that I showed you and then I have my water 10 ounces of water 5 ounces of the cranberry diet cranberry juice and that is what I had planned for breakfast. So five smart points total the wrap is four the entire wrap. I mixed these two up so this I had for breakfast, this I had for lunch, but it was exactly the same thing. I just had switched them around. Having one of my muffins and I'm still working on the same coffee. This is first snack today. Four smart points. My second cup of coffee here and I'm still working on my first cup of water. Noon is working on a bone. Making my lunch, which I'm having the smoked, cured, uncured ham again. Three slices of that is zero smart points. It's under an ounce and a quarter. And I'm having two slices of the Sara Lee Delightful 45 calorie bread. One slice of Velveeta cheese and I'm gonna throw my egg in here. I got my bacon or my ham on there. And I'm just going to fry up this egg. When I put it on bread, I always break the yolk so it spreads out there a little bit. A little salt and pepper and that will be it. So I just put my egg on top of my ham there, and that is what I'm having for lunch. Super easy, and I'm sick today, so I'm taking it easy today. With my lunch, I'm having a diet Dr. Pepper, and this is five smart points. I added some of the hot sauce on there as well, just for some fun. 114 grams of apple for 111 calories and zero smart points is what's for snack. I'm having my second muffin of the day for four smart points. 
feeling my water today guys but I'm trying to get it in I'm having my 20 actually this is 25 ounces and I'm adding my other half of my diet cranberry which is five ounces of that because this is a 10 ounce serving and I just add half to each one just for a little bit of flavor that is my second glass only and it is five o'clock so yeah I'm really pokey today on my water but I'm gonna try to get one more in tonight and just plain water all right I have dinner here which is just gonna be a cup of chili with one point a quarter ounce of Asiago cheese in that that is my dinner tonight because we are sick and we're having leftovers because I don't feel like cooking and I just wanted to mention too on this recipe if you put in like the nutrition stuff into the app of the Weight Watchers Builder thing you're not going to come up with four smart points because this does not know that like the pumpkin is zero points and the blueberries and strawberries are zero points so or the raspberries i mean so this is going to be if you just put this in like this it's going to come up as seven smart points but it's actually really four smart points if you put it in the app builder recipe builder which we did and it came up to four smart points on the purple plan it is only one smart point because the old-fashioned oats are zero as well good evening guys i am sick today so i've been trying to keep this video short didn't put any makeup on have my same shirt on from yesterday, which it isn't dirty because I did nothing yesterday. The main thing is I did, had another great day today. Even though I was sick, I always seem to wanna splurge when I'm sick, but today I like did the opposite. I've got my planner done here and I did figure out my calories on today's and yesterday's. Yesterday's it came to 1391 calories and then today's was well, depending on whether or not I have an extra muffin, which I am considering, which would be my third one for the night, I am at 1648. I have seven points left over right now as I stand after dinner. Here's just a little close up of what I did not have. So I crossed off the barbecue and the premier protein. So I had eight for snacks. So I had two muffins. And then down here, I put in the extra muffin, which I probably still will have. And then I crossed out the sour cream because I decided not to have that in my chili. So that saved another point. So now I'm at, you know, seven points left. Luna, Eclipse, quit teasing her. They're just like kids, like children. They fight all the time. Okay, so that is, that is it. My plan with the muffin, that's my calories that I have. And then yesterday's was my lowest calories, 1391. And I did have two waters today. I just haven't filled them in. I'm planning on having one more before bed yet. So my decision now is whether or not I want cheese, an ounce of cheese, which is four, or a muffin, which is four. <laughs> because I'm going to have something tonight yet. I always have a snack of some sort. I had planned on having my chips and a Diet Dr. Pepper, which isn't going to happen now. So I'll probably end up having another muffin for the third time today. I love those muffins so much. You guys know I eat them every day on my channel now since I've found them. I found them on Instagram. No, I found them on Pinterest somewhere and I found several different recipes and we just made up our own and this is what we came up with. So it's all over the place. There's different ways to make it and this is the way we found that was the most tasty in our opinion anyway. Corey loves them. I love them and they are delicious. You can actually keep the berries out and put chocolate chips in them for your kids and they are delicious. My son loves them that way and it's healthier than a bar or something because it has real oatmeal in it. A lot of good ingredients in that muffin. So I want to stick to right around 1500 as close as I can get to that which is what my doctor recommended. So that's what I'm going to try to do. My total weight loss as of since I started this was 3.8 pounds so far. I, we didn't go to the meeting today, but it would have been technically up from the meeting because I haven't been weighing in at the meeting and it would still be up. But next week it should actually be down from Weight Watchers even. So that's cool. <laughs> and my husband had lost weight too, but he had gained like eight over the holiday season, but he's back down to where he belongs now. So there's no worry there. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hit 9,000 subscribers this morning and I was just floored, so thrilled about it. So my goal this year is to reach 10,000 subscribers and I think I can do it in a year. I hope so. And as you can see, I'm eating all of my favorite foods, which I think is very, very important to stay on a weight loss plan is you eat things you love. If it's over and over again, so be it. Eat that anyway. I love these foods that you've been seeing for the last four days. It's been so easy to stay on track because I love these foods. 
eat what you love. I think that will really help. Even if it doesn't match the guidelines that you're supposed to be doing, at least that's a start. And then start adding more things on like vegetables and fruits and stuff like that, the healthier things. Start adding those in your plan because there's zero points. So you can add them in as you go, maybe after you do a week or two of getting back on track adding in those other things later on will definitely help. That's what I'm going to do. I've been trying to add as many vegetables in as I can, but I'm not a huge vegetable eater. Again, thank you so much for watching. Thank you for subscribing. I will see you guys all tomorrow for January 5th, what I ate, and we will talk to you soon. Bye guys.